All right, my dudes, welcome to another episode of The Walking Dead Survivor's Will of Hope. Today I'm going to be talking about, I'm only going to do a few Will of Hopes uh, because I don't, don't have as many gems. Maybe I'll do the Whisperers in this video too. So, um, let's do it. I don't. Okay, so they have Princess featured, and but they don't have, but it's okay, whatever. This is pretty good. Okay, so if you haven't watched my previous Will of Hope, it's good that you do both of these deals. So you do the one uh, spin for 250 gems and then you do a five spins for 2250 gems okay so here is the i'll do the one spin i already did my free spin for the day off of a video so about that people 10 people dying at the astro world concert you see i never was a travis scott fan i could uh that song, Goosebumps, I don't have it saved on my phone, but uh, that's the only real, that's really the only Travis Scott song that I can actually listen to. Like, okay, so that's pretty good. Million Me, yeah, well, shmeh, I, I, I would have been happier with some uh, fragments, so we're going to do... Five more, but yeah, uh, there's no coincidence. I don't know if you guys believe in the spirit world, or or you're one of these people who don't who think witchcraft and sorcery and all of that stuff. You you think that's just make believe. And that they don't have true, like, actual wizards, witches, warlocks, and evil spirits, and all kinds of stuff. That there's no spirit realm. I don't know what you guys believe in. But uh, I definitely believe in the spirit world. I think there, well, I know that there are actual witches and warlocks and people performing spells on people and all that. And... How that's relative to um, what happened at Astral World? You know, recently we've been having a lot of blood moons and new moons that's close, super close, and uh, you know, just around this time of year. Okay, so let me give you cultural context uh, for this time of the year. Um, uh, before there were freezers and all of that, um, uh, you would have one last harvest uh, before winter started because uh, after that, everything would just start dying and all of that. So that last harvest before that, that, that first, you know, that first uh, frost, the first frost, that's what it's called by the meteorologist, that first frost and everything start dying and, and nothing is, is really going to grow after that first frost. Cause then all of the crops and plants go dormant. Um, there would just be a big celebration, uh, for that harvest and during this season uh as far as the spirit realm and occult practices and witchcraft and sorcery and all of that people would take their uh their uh crops and harvest and sacrifice them to their pagan deities so you know hoping that they would make it through the winter cuz you know, you probably were not going to make like back then they didn't have heaters and all of that. So like people just died during the winter. So people did all kinds of stuff, you know, what I mean, in place of the technology that we have today, which a lot of that is witchcraft, too. 
Okay, depending on it just depends on how much you study that thing, how much you study things like that. And a lot of the technology that we use today, it, it you know, it really is witchcraft. And there was primitive versions of the stuff that we use today. Um, they existed as witchcraft before. And now we just consider them as regular uh, uh, science, you know, as witchcraft has proliferated in the world and sorcery has proliferated in the world, the physical world and what's available in the spirit world and what's available in the physical world has become like very close and the line is blurred between what is witchcraft and what is uh what is you know what is in the spirit realm and what is in the physical realm i like how i like what if you if you guys are familiar with that tv show legend of cora i like how they i like how they call that blurring of the line between the physical and spirit world they call it harmonic convergence so like i think towards the, the finale they had a harmonic convergence where uh you know you you had uh the evil spirit you had the the spirit of light uh uh vatu and then no i think the spirit of light was rava and then you had the spirit of darkness, Vatu. I just know it was Vatu and Rava. So maybe the light one was Vatu and Rava was the dark spirit. And every thousand years or something, uh, they have a fight. And one of them takes over and all of that stuff. And during that fight is harmonic convergence it, when the spirit realm and everything that line between the two gets blurred and then you just you start just literally seeing physical man's manifestations of things in the spirit world literally we are in a harmonic convergence like to be honest, like this video game and cell phones and YouTube, to be honest, it's witchcraft. To be honest, it's all witchcraft, but it's blurred together. It's like you are physically interacting with something that is spiritual. You know what I mean? But there's a bunch of things you can get into with that, but... That's essentially what happened at this Astro World concert. You know what I mean? Deep harmonic convergence. If you don't believe in demons, demonic activity, and stuff like that, uh, the Travis Scott concert should uh, be your little wake up call that yes, demons are real. Yes, you know what I mean? Uh, yes, it just yes. Like all of that stuff that. You know, you thought it was just uh, Harry Potter and all of that. You thought that was just fantasy. Well, it's not really fantasy. These these spiritual entities actually exist. And, and we're starting to see them manifest. Um, we've seen... We're starting to see them manifest. Um, uh this is a very spiritual uh prophetic if you believe in the most high it's a very spiritual time it's very there i say biblical time to be alive um we all know that we haven't had there hasn't been a, a pandemic like the coronavirus this pandemic is special <laughs> okay this is a very special pandemic and just the the events and things leading up to it and what happened during it it's a very spiritual thing there's a spiritual element there's a physical element uh with the virus and all that but there's a spiritual element like people are losing their minds people are taking on demons you know is road rage all over the place you know people shooting each other over masks just people just 
want to troll and fight and just be nasty, just constant bitterness. Like these people are demon possessed. Okay. If you don't believe in demons after what you've seen, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you, but they, they real. The spirit world is real. Magic is real. Uh, child sacrifice. You know what I mean? Those people at that concert, they want to say a sacrifice, but you know what I mean? Yeah, it, it, it probably was. And during this time of the year, in the past, yeah, people would snatch up kids and sacrifice this and sacrifice that um, to their pagan deities so they could make it through the winter. So, yeah, that's pretty interesting. But I didn't do too many of uh, the what's the uh, what's the name because I don't have that many gems. But I did want to comment on Astro World on my YouTube channel. I hope. um you guys who watch this you go ahead on and check out this game check out the rest of the videos on my channel uh this game is awesome um i'm recruiting in my clan if you are a noob if you decide to play the game watch my first youtube video that teaches you how to come to my server and join my clan and come play with me and we can talk of if you're into uh, occult stuff or if you're into, uh, you know, not Travis Scott, but you pay attention to hip hop, you care about hip hop. See, I don't see. I don't care about sports. You know, what I mean, I'll watch a boxing match, but I don't, you know, and I played sports. You understand? And I, I I'd rather play sports. But see, uh, hip hop music. That's my that's my sports. You know what I mean? I care like I care what happens with music because I don't know. Is an is not repetitive. You always have new things to look forward to and I feel like cuz like I played Madden 05 and the and I love Madden 05, but once you play the one, the 05, why are you playing it each year? You know it's the same game. So I can't do that, you know, repetitive stuff. So if it's too repetitive, but see, music always changing and evolving and all of that. So it keeps my attention. So I care about music. I listen to all kinds of music. Yes, even country. I love country music. I don't I don't understand the hate. I really don't. But uh country music is delicious even though I don't uh, agree with the cultural undertones of it, you know what I mean? A lot of a lot of the cultural undertones uh I do enjoy a contra a music but yeah you guys thanks for watching check out the other videos on my channel um toodles